What is up, Fitpreneurs? Anthony Rudolph, the Fitpreneur, coming at you today. So, how is your day going so far? How was your yesterday? How was the day before? How are you setting yourself up for success? And how are you achieving your goal to be a total Fitpreneur? Mind, body, soul, spirit, legacy. What are you doing to prepare yourself for that? So I was reading this morning and I saw a step that I was pretty familiar with, but every time I read it, I'm just so, so astonished um, and kind of ashamed um, that 40% of our children grow up without their biological father. Almost 40% of our children grow up without their biological father around or in the house. And I guess the big reason why, why it hurt me is because I experienced that. My father wasn't around. I remember um, meeting him one time when I was about 13 years old. Um, and the memory that I have of my father is a memory that I won't share um, because it's, it's kind of a negative memory, but it sticks out. And I know throughout my life, throughout my experiences, I've, I've done, I've said, um, and I've experienced things that I would not have experienced if I had that positive role model as a father in my life. You know, um, I tell people sometimes that, you know, where I am now, I am I am glad that in a sense that my father wasn't around because in most cases, the, the son ends up um, as a duplicate of the father. And where my father is right now in his life, I thank God that he left because I do not want to be anything like the man that um, that gave me life. But now as a father, I have a purpose. My purpose is to to be the man, to be the father that's that's in the house with them, encouraging, protecting, providing them because I know that that a lot of us men, we make so many mistakes in our life that we would not make if we had that father, that positive father in the house. And I just want to encourage you guys as as men, as fitpreneurs, as kings that are out there doing what needs to be done for their family, do what you need to do to stay put. Do what you need to do to stay in in your your kids life because they need us there. They need us there um, protecting, uh, cheerleading, uh, encouraging, um, telling them it's gonna be okay. They need us to be present. And one thing that I kinda had to shift, shift my mindset is, is that we have to leave all our crap at the door because as businessmen, we have bad days. As businessmen, uh, things don't always go well. As businessmen, we want to be upset when a deal doesn't go the way we want to, or we don't. We're not as productive as we want to that day, or we don't make as as much money as we want to that day, and we sometimes tend to take that stuff home with us. Um, so I encourage you guys to just leave your your crappy day at the door. Leave it there because vibes are everything. Um, our wives, our kids, even though they don't say anything, they can feel the vibe that we bring into the house. And if it's a crappy, bad day, bad sales, bad client day, they're going to feel that. And, and as a father, if you tend to have bad days and you go home and you don't connect with your family, that compounds. You know, one day, yeah, it's okay, but two days, three days, four days, four months, four years of disconnecting with your family can compound, and that's when things start to go crazy. So my my commitment, my decision is to leave the bad days at the door before I walk in, because I'm gonna walk in as at giving my family good vibes, good positive vibes, because I want that to compound. I want the, the good vibes to compound over four days, four months, and four years, okay? So guys, whatever we need to do to be present in our kids' life, we have to do. 
we do not want our children to be a a negative stat because that 40 percent most likely will increase if we don't do what we need to do as fathers to stay in our kids life and as business businessmen to leave our crap at the door and not bring those bad vibes into our house all right so hope you guys make the best of the rest of this day all right we'll talk to you guys soon bye bye